New Brunswick is known for epic snowmobiling, so we've come to Bathurst. The trails here are wide open with elevation. We're looking forward to that, but also visiting some of the impressive clubhouses along the way. So clubhouses can be found throughout the system here in New Brunswick, and they really become part of the community and are a hub for activities in that local area. And some of them, like the clubhouse here behind me, have got a great reputation for food. I'm told this one here at the Super Village Trailblazers Club has got the best club sandwich in Canada. I'm gonna go find out. food on the trail. We've, uh, we've got a great uh, kitchen crew and uh, big, big portions and we've built on it over the years. Uh, keep kind of adding based on, uh, you know, what people want and what they're asking for and try to have everybody leave with a full belly. Well, the winters are long, so uh, I guess it's something that brings everybody together and uh, gives us a, a reason to get out and enjoy. Uh, it helps helps the community it's giving a, you know most of us are volunteers the girls that that do work in the kitchen are the employees so it gives them a, a job for the winter and uh, just just brings brings everybody together when we host events we've got the locals coming out and we've got the crew that we you know we volunteer together all the time it, it builds friendships and the the social part of it and the family part of it and the snowmobiling it's, it's kind of more than more than just a snowmobile club. We hear our trails are, are one of the, the best systems around. We've got uh, some beautiful scenery here. We've got the Jacket River Gorge that uh, people like to go and stop and have a little look out. Just, you can see down in the valley and coming through, you're, you're coming through a little bit of, uh, you know, the tight windy trails and you get the, the, the open stretches. And so I think we've got a little bit of everything. The spirit is, is very high in New Brunswick for snowmobiling. We have what we call white gold. It's, a, it's, a, it's always here, especially in northern New Brunswick where the snow levels are much higher. We have a tremendous amount of traffic coming in from our neighboring provinces, Nova Scotia and Prince Edward Island. And they, uh, they, they come in here, well, we have 1,200 members at our lodge and 400 of them are from Nova Scotia, Prince Edward Island. So it's uh, absolutely a, a major uh, working force for us. I mean, we, we, it, it drives the economy in the wintertime. Yeah, well, in order to service our members, uh, we, we have to have uh, shelters and we also have to have clubhouses that are located far enough apart that we can get fuel for the machines and also the warming shelters, of course, to, to uh, enable people to pull over and rest and get warm because it can get cold up here. It's not, not unusual to see minus 25 on the trail. So those warming shelters come in pretty handy. Uh, and they're just, they're just part of the service that we offer. And I think that's one of the reasons we draw so many people in, having these clubhouses for fuel and it's very convenient for the, for the people that are coming in here from outside. Riding in the trails in New Brunswick, one of the things that we've come across is a number of gems out on the trails, like the lodge behind me, Serpentine Lodge. Trust me, this is one place, if you ride in this area, you gotta come here to experience Alir and what he's got to offer. Plus, he's got gas. So if you don't come here and get gas, you're probably not gonna be able to keep going. Alir has been with us. Uh, he's at the end of our trail system. He's been here almost 25 years. Uh, he basically looks after the, the lodge here himself with a little bit of help. And uh, yeah, he's a destination point. We, we have members that come in and uh, we've got to get to Willier's. He's, he's at the end of the system at Serpentine Lodge and it's, uh, it's a really, uh, it's a very convenient. You can gas up when you get here and have a nice meal as we just had. Uh, so uh, yeah, he's, he's a, a special person.
This is my 25th winter. Yeah, I'm 100 miles from every city. Like 100 miles from Batters, 100 miles from Grand Falls, Edmonston 148, Predator 138, Moose Valley 148. It's right dead center. Uh, Butch, he's the, he's the host over here. Everybody takes pictures of him, everybody comes back to see him, not to see me. <laughs> Well, it's, it's actually great and we're very fortunate here to have this so-called white gold that we call our snow conditions that we do have here in the winter. And uh, we take advantage of it and uh, we have created a, a market in the area along with the, uh, the snowmobile clubs that operate here. There are two major ones. So it's a uh, it's very important market for us and uh, for the winter time and then summertime we're a tourist haven as well. It really helps to understand really what this recreational market's all about and uh, how one can enjoy it and how people do enjoy it. So as a result of that, I think we have uh, developed a very good infrastructure in northern New Brunswick here and through New Brunswick itself. And uh, we participate in that. So we provide services here at the hotel that includes a heated garage for storage or help out if you have problems, trail problems. And uh, we're on the trail, so that's a very good good part of it. And, uh, no, I enjoy snowmobiling as well and have over the years. Please.